checking out on the sled up Pueblo west of the casino. Sky 7 earlier flying over that scene. We had this is breaking news all afternoon and our coverage continues with reporter Alyssa Munoz. Yeah, Darlene, Doug, Bernalillo County Fire Department is just one of seven agencies that helped out today to put out the fire and officials say this is just the beginning. Uh, this fire, while it looked impressive, uh, was really just in the salt cedar, which is around the river. Um, those fires always look very intense. Uh, they produce a, a ton of smoke, but uh, they're relatively easy to control and the crews did a, a good job of doing that today. That brush fire reported this afternoon on the west side of Isleta Casino near Tribal Road 87. Chief Prop says they were able to stop it before it reached the bosque. No one was hurt in the fire and only one building that you see from Sky 7 was caught in the fire. That house is abandoned and has actually been involved in fire before. Um, so, you know, obviously anytime a structure is involved, we, we don't like to see that, but it sounds like this one may have already been a loss from a previous fire. The fire even causing the rail runner to shut down for a few hours. We did have a disruption in rail runner service for a while. The, uh, the railroad track was kind of splitting two areas of the fire, so for the safety of our crews who are working in the area, we, we shut down rail traffic. With hot temperatures and dry areas, Chief Prop says there will probably be more fires going forward. Here's what residents can do to help. Make sure your property is, is manicured, um, no overgrown weeds, uh, especially things that go right up to your house. We want to make sure that there's not fuel that comes right up to your structure. Uh, be firewise when you're burning. You know, even if it says it's a burn day, be cognizant of what the wind looks like. Isleta Pueblo's fire department will now be taking over to monitor it. Reporting in Albuquerque, I'm Melissa Munoz, KYT Action 7 News. The cause of that fire is still under investigation.